today I am doing a slime room tour. I've been working on this for quite a while now. Um, and now I'm back to filming like more professional videos. So yeah, but I'm really excited to show you guys my like slime room. I think it looks really nice, but yeah, it's, it's like half my slime room and then half my school room. Because if you guys didn't know, I am doing virtual school for middle school. I'm now going to real middle school. So, uh, yeah, but anyways, I'm super excited to show you guys the tour, and, um, yeah, let's get on to it. ta -da! Okay, so, when you first log in, you see this sign, and it says Bunny Slime Factory, with a little heart and a star. I have this really cute pen holder, which I just have my little markers in it to write on the whiteboard. So, yeah, I think the whiteboard looks super cute. And then, you keep coming, you keep coming. And then you see my desk. So, yeah, down here I just have some random, like, I don't even know what these are. Do you guys have any video ideas or just, like, craft ideas for these? Definitely comment those because I don't know what to do with these. <laughs> um, and then in this blue bin, I have a bunch of containers as well as some silicone mats. So, yeah. Okay. So, come over here in this really dirty chair because it has a lot of paint on it. Um, underneath is just all the cords. And then right there I have all of my books, bookmarks. And then down here is all of my homemade squishies. So, here are a few that I've made. I'm not going to do a whole collection in this video just because it'll take a very long time. But yeah, here's just my squishy bento box. And then here's a bunch of homemade squishies. Here's some ones I'm working on. And um, yeah, there's some paint, a cup of paintbrushes, and some fabric glue. So yeah, that's on the first bottom shelf. And then here I just have a bunch of Diary of a Wimpy Kid books, um, Weird But True books, and then some scented bookmarks. So yeah, those are the two bottom shelves. You come up and you see my awesome computer. Don't look at me. Um, I have an Amazon mouse, you know, just a regular computer. Back here, I have a really cute cactus. I'm not gonna touch it because um, it scares me, it scares me, it scares me. It scares me. But we don't need to talk about that. Behind here is some really cute flowers. They're like plastic. Um, here's my lamp. Usually focus it there, but you know. I have a water bottle, some chapstick, and this really little like cute uh, little pen holder, some scissors, two pencils, and an eraser. Right here I have my Zen sand garden. I really love this thing. Um, and then in on this thing I have some bunch of my favorite guns. I don't have anything in these little containers. I don't know what to put in there. But yeah, turn around. And here's all my schoolwork. I just have a bunch of, you know, studying things. Here's like volume and formulas you know and then here's all the skeleton bones i have some little pens down here i have a whiteboard as well as a work in progress folder some tissues obviously <laughs> i have this really cute thing that i got on a cruise one time it's just like little sticky note things i don't know it's really cute got it at lost mine kingdom and then i have a math book a little extra page clip thing underneath the Mac, math book, math book, math book, math book. I just have two um, random notebooks that don't have any writings in it yet. And then I have this really cute um, plant. And then this do it all desk set. It just has some really cute stuff in it. So yeah, that's that shelf. Then up top here, I have my microscope, some little microscope pads, and then a bunch of different things for the microscope. I have like some dead um, animals. If you don't like seeing skeleton bones and stuff, then skip this part. So what I have here is just some random like slides, some sticks, you know, some coloring. I have a turtle shell. <laughs> and then here is some skeletons of a rat that we found in um, owl poop. <laughs> yeah, but that is that. Then you'll come over here, this really cute trash can. You know, just your basic trash can. And then, the slime area. 
Okay, so the first cubby has all of my store-bought slimes that I bought from other shops and stuff. So, yeah, that's all that. Next is just some slimes that I never got to putting in containers. Here we have strawberry patch, uh, jelly cube, uh, galaxy crunch, and then apple pie filling. So, yeah, that's that cubby. And then the very bottom one is just some dice clay. Looks like I need to get more because I'm running out. But, yeah. Here's the next cubby. It just has some six ounce and eight ounce containers. Some slime for my shop. And then I have a gallon of Amazon white glue and some Elmer's glue all. Next, I have some more Amazon white glue and some more Elmer's glue all. And then I have some crazy art glue. I have some glue all and school glue. And then here I have a gallon of Amazon clear glue, as well as little tiny clear glues that I'm selling on my shop. So yeah. Also the link to my shop will be in the description. Okay, anyways. Next thing is some more slime for my shop. More slime for my shop. More slime for my shop, 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 more slime for my shop. And then these two drawers have more slime that I never put in containers, which I am working on, as you can see. Um, so yeah, but th that's what's in all of those shelves. Now onto the top. Down here I have some eight ounce containers, some two ounce containers, some more two ounce containers. I have these little pipettes for slime softener. Um, I just have all my colorings right here. I have some pigment and paint in here. I don't know what those random foam beads are doing. Here I just have a bunch of glitter. I also have a bag of glass, some little cute add-ins. So, yeah. Next I have some rubber bands, which I cut up to use for sprinkles. I have some, like, watermelon, lemon, female slices. These actually go to this slime, Lionel Lemonade. I have an extra container. I should probably put that in here. Anyways, I have some microfoam beads, some eight ounce containers for myself and my personal slimes. I have some random colors of foam beads. I have some regular, um, like, medium-sized white foam beads. I have some scents. I have some, like, uh, shredded-up styrofoam. And then I have a bunch of more colors of foam beads. Some glitter. And some Clorox wipes. So, that's this whole cabinet. Now onto this. So, up top, I have all of my putties. Um, you know, just a bunch of crazy Evans putties. Back here, I have some little mochis. I like little squishy toys. And then I have a pair of scissors. And then in this drawer, I have some slime ingredients. Baby oil, fake snow, cornstarch, uh, coconut oil, glycerin, um, shaving gel, lotion, guar gum, shaving cream, and jelly cubes. And then in the drawer under that, I just have a bunch of toys. I have a few paper squishies. And some like floof and junk like that. So yeah, you come over here. I have two little chalkboards. Don't know what to do with those. I have a bunch of Scotch shipping tape. This little thing that I just used to scrape off my table. So yeah, you'll get more details into the table later. Um, this drawer, I have a bunch of my homemade slimes. This whole drawer is just of my homemade slimes. So, yeah. That one never really closes that well. Um, more homemade slimes. So that's all of my slimes in my collection. Anyways, you come over here. And you got this really cute lamp. You just push that in and then boom. I got some hand sanitizer for when I do my orders. I need to make sure that my hands are super clean. Here is the keys for my little locker drawer thing. There's just my tripod. Got some tape, some borax, 
um, my little black sheet cards, some heart stickers, um, some priority mail boxes, some shipping tape, Sharpie, pencil, notepad, and scissors. Now, into this, it's a little disorganized, but I mean, no one ever sees it, and as long as I can find stuff, then I don't really care. Here are all my little shipping bags. Got some bubble wrapped bags and you know, stuff like that. Here are my little Brax bags, my extra bags. Back here, I have some cookies for orders. Uh, I have a bunch of bubble wrap. It actually is just like a roll, but I kind of had to wrinkle it up so it would fit in there. <laughs> so yeah, that is that one cow nut. This one has some labels and some stickers. This one has just some little extras. Has my business cards and then some more bubble wrap my table this is my squishy side where I paint on my squishies and then this is the slime side as you can see it's super clean so that's why it is the slime side um, so yeah that's where I paint all my squishies it looks kind of gross but trust me it is just paint so yeah but that is basically my whole slime room tour I really hope you guys enjoyed this video now we'll be um, like uploading more professional videos and yeah i'm really proud of how this looks and i think it looks really good so yeah but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it give it a big thumbs up and um yeah also don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications if you haven't already anyways i love you guys so much and i'll see you in the next video bye <laughs> what are you doing silly so cute hey zozo What is he doing? He's trying to get into the food. He's so silly. Zoe, you're so cute. Look at this dude. I'm so cute. <laughs> you're just smelling my drink. She's smelling my drink. This is not for the bunnies. No. You will get sick if you have that. <laughs> oh, Tiffany! Hi! <laughs> By the way, guys, this is not my turtle. This is my teacher's turtle. But he always lets me keep her for the summer. Good girl. Good boy. So just got some fan mail, so watch out for that video. Until you find your way back home.